So uh, today we'll be checking out the uh, new plugin uh, for the open card platform based web stores that's the multi-level marketing or the MLM extension. So now if you want to grow and earn as your affiliate network expands and you also want to manage your network marketing in open card with multi-level marketing extension and this plugin is a good to go. This plugin basically allows you to handle multiple tiers of affiliates or the parents and their sub affiliates that are the children the admin can manage the tree view from the back end and the affiliates can earn the bonuses for their first child affiliate and can uh, keep earning subsequent bonuses for uh, for the affiliates three level completion as their network keeps on growing apart from that the admin can view and approve the transactions for all of the bonuses that have been earned by the affiliates within the open gap platform based web store so i'll just take you through the workflow so i'll just be giving you the uh, idea of what different options are there under the account panel so uh, for a brief uh, overview i'll uh, be creating a new video and uh, i'll be adding that to this particular video's playlist as well and before we proceed further please do subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to receive the latest updates apart from that if you find this particular video helpful then do kindly give it a thumbs up. So you can see that I'm at the uh, Open Card platform based web show wherein I've installed my Open Card multi level marketing plugin. And here you can see that uh, we are on the sign in page wherein a uh, user can register as a new affiliate as well. To do so, he'll have to tap here on the continue button. And if you are already an affiliate, you can directly log into your uh, affiliate account by entering your username, password, and then tapping on the login button now this is the affiliate programs uh, registration page as you can see and you'll have to fill up all of these details here uh, that includes your password your payment information uh, your basic uh, account details along with your address and after that you can create an affiliate uh, account there now for example if you already created one uh, you can basically log into your account and can then uh, perform different functions as well now here on the right hand side you can see that uh, we have uh, the transaction section affiliate tracking and the payment option so let's log into the uh, affiliate account so after logging in you can see that on the left hand side we have my tracking information my transactions and my affiliate account having the options to edit change your account password or the payment preferences as well and on the right hand side we have a default my account edit account password here we have the uh, payment uh, options, we have the affiliate tracking, transactions and we have the multi-level marketing. Now under the multi-level marketing we have my affiliate referrals, uh, MLM membership, MLM tree and about MLM. So let's look through each of these options where different uh, settings are there. So the very first one that we have is the my affiliate referral. So here uh, the affiliate can basically generate a referral link that can be used by the other ones and uh, you can just tap here uh, to get a referral link you have to just tap on that and that brings up the uh, same now this is a, a referral one so if anyone joins in as a uh, affiliate then he'll come under your tree if you're the parent he'll be your child and similarly your child can also uh, provide his referral code to another child that comes under that and all of this particular tree comes uh, up under your parental uh, tree itself. Now, uh, thereafter, we have the MLM membership. So under this section, uh, you'll be uh, able to subscribe for the membership. Initially, this uh, section would have to apply to the MLM membership, but I've already done that. So it says you're already subscribed for the membership. And thereafter, uh, let's go to the other options that we have under multi-level marketing. Uh, we have the MLM tree. So here is myself, the affiliate. I have two uh, sub-childs. My one sub-child has uh, two more sub-childs. And uh, you can see how this particular thing works. Just like a tree at the top, we have the root and then we have the branches uh, there. So this is how the affiliate marketing works. Uh, for example, if we have new rock, he can also give his uh, affiliate link to someone to join under him. Those two will join under him, but all of the collective uh, thing would be under the John Doe itself. 
Lastly, we have the about MLM and here you can set up the MLM uh, info from the backend and would be visible to the uh, uh, affiliates at the storefront. So here you can see that the members can add up to two affiliates only by using his uh, member referral ID. So only two uh, affiliates can be the subchild and the main parent can provide uh, only one uh, referral for his two there. Uh, then we have set up some text that how the MLM works and about the referral code. We have given some info there. Now uh, this info is visible at the uh, storefront as well. So for example, if I go back uh, to the home page and, uh, and here on the login page, you can find uh, the login section here. So uh, that's uh, those were the options under the MLM info when we can set the, uh, set the different uh, uh, data for the MLM terms conditions, how the MLM works and about the referral code as well. Now apart from that you have the option to uh, track the affiliate. So if I go to the affiliate tracking under the options here, uh, here you can see that uh, uh, basically this section is about like for example, to make sure that you uh, get paid for the referrals you send uh, to us and uh, therefore we need to track the referrals by placing a tracking code in the URLs linking to us. So uh, the affiliate can make use of the tools given uh, below to generate the links uh, for the store or the, for that particular web, uh, website. So here is our uh, tracking code that we need to enter. Uh, we can uh, enter the data here uh, for the tracking link generator. And here we can create the tracking link and then we can tap here in the continue button so as uh, uh, that we make sure that we get uh, paid for the referrals we are sending out to the actual uh, website owner there. Now uh, coming to the uh, transactions here. So here the uh, affiliate can find the complete list of uh, transaction along with the current balance that is there that he has earned. So here you can see the date edit. The description is that the referral level commission bonus was assigned to this particular affiliate and the amount was uh, for $500. So similarly, whenever any affiliate joins uh, under your tree and the tree keeps on going, then on the each and every referral level that you have set, the commission bonus for that uh, would be added under your uh, transactions there whenever the uh, admin does so. And uh, after the uh, transactions, now let's hop on to the admin backend panel and let's see how we can configure this uh, particular plugin from the admin backend panel. So for that, I'll just enter my username, password and tap here in the uh, login button. So after the successful installation of this particular plugin, you'll have the web cool MLM uh, multi-level marketing uh, option on the side panel of the admin having the uh, option to directly navigate to the configuration settings. We have the membership requests, uh, the MLM received bonus, and the MLM affiliate tree. You can navigate through extension extensions, then tap on the webcool MLM to make a configuration, or you can quickly raise that particular section by just tapping here in the config section link. Now here you can see that we had set the te text uh, terms and conditions uh, that uh, we were just uh, watching at the storefront uh, workflow. So from here you'll be able to set up uh, like the status of this particular MLM marketing uh, plugin. So if you want to have this functionality within your open card platform based web stores, then you just need to make this uh, option for the status as enabled, otherwise choose it as a uh, disabled. And from the drop down, you can choose your store within which you want to have this particular functionality of the multi-level marketing. Then we have around four tabs here for the terms and conditions, how MLM works, MLM configuration, and the MLM extra bonus. Under the terms and conditions, we have set up the terms and conditions, and these are visible to the customers at the uh, store uh, front. So uh, I'll just show you that as well. Now let's come to the how MLM works. This is the same thing that I just showed you in the front end, that how the MLM works. This is the MLM configuration wherein the admin will be able to set up the membership amount. You can set up the referral code can be used for. So for example, I'm a, I register as an affiliate and I'm using my referral code to uh, add more uh, subchilds under my own uh, account there. Then what happens is that the admin can restrict the use of the respective affiliate uh, referral code. So, so uh, if there's a limit for two, I can uh, provide this uh, 
uh, referral code uh, to two more sub uh, affiliates only so that's up to you how you want to set that up and uh, then you have the about referral code so here we can uh, set the uh, the uh, title or what you see as the how this uh, referral code works then under the MLM extra bonus we can set up the level commission so for each level we can set up a uh, amount uh, that would be uh, sent out to that particular affiliate so for the level one we have to set it as 500 2000 and third level is 1500 you can remove any of these to add one uh, to add the commission just tap here enter the amount choose whether it's a fixed one or a uh, percentage under the matrix type now if you have a first child then we can set it as the first child bonus if you want to enable the first child bonus you can choose it enabled otherwise choose it as a disabled the matrix type uh, would be uh, like if you want to have that uh, particular bonus as a fixed one uh, then whatever amount you enter would be the fixed one otherwise it would be a percentage of that particular thing so here i've set it as fixed and it's 300 then we have a level completion bonus so whenever an affiliate completes uh, some kind of a set uh, level uh, then he receives a level completion bo uh, bonus and that can be enabled or disabled from this section and we can choose it, that uh, level completion bonus as a fixed one or a percentage one and the same goes for the amount we can set the uh, amount as fixed or percentage and then enter the same uh, in the amount section now to make these uh, uh, changes here you'll have to tap here in the save button and we are done with the initial configurations for this uh, plugin now let's go to the membership request then uh, the MLM uh, receive bonuses and lastly the MLM affiliate tree so uh, whenever any customer comes in and registers himself as a as an affiliate he has the option uh, to request for a membership now after uh, requesting for the membership all of the requests are being displayed here under this particular section for the membership request under the web pool MML, MLM and then the membership request so from here to approve anyone uh, you can tap this uh, thumbs icon you can view the details of the uh, person as well uh, his affiliate address uh, the uh, parent affiliate who, who actually is the affiliate MLM uh, mm, Parent affiliate, his membership status, uh, and the names of his uh, left child affiliate, right child affiliate, and so on. So let's go back. Now, uh, after that, we have the MLM receive bonuses. So, uh, depending upon what we have chosen, uh, uh, the for example, we have set the first child bonus, we have set the referral level commission bonus, or we have set up the level completion child amount bonus. So, whatever you have set up according to that. Uh, the respective affiliate would be receiving the balance for each of them and uh, to transfer the amount to those uh, affiliates uh, the admin can go to the actions column and then he'll have to tap here in the make transaction button and uh, and the transaction would be added uh, for that and that uh, particular affiliate would then be removed out of here who has received the MLM uh, bonus for the different uh, descriptions there and apart from that the uh, admin can also add all transaction at the same time by tapping here and then tapping ok on the prompt that you can see and that would uh, basically uh, set the bonus to all so basically you need to check all of these options first and then add all transaction then ok then all of these would be receiving uh, their transaction amount depending upon the description uh, for each and lastly coming to the web pool MLM we have the affiliate tree and here uh, the admin can check any of the affiliate tree structure by filtering their name so here you need to enter your affiliate name and you can then tap here in the filter button okay let me uh, change the name there and uh, then we'll be filtering the tree so here you can see that Jack has only two sub charts as Stormy and the Jerry Doe and this is uh, the main parent uh, MLM affiliate tree as you can see. So uh, that was much about the uh, open cart uh, plugin uh, that's the MLM uh, multi-level marketing extension for your open cart pl platform based web stores. So uh, I hope it helped you out in understanding the flow of the same if you still have any questions, queries, suggestions or requirements then kindly do reach back to us at support at the or visit it at webcooler.com. 
You can also contact us through uh, www.webquill.com forward slash contact. And lastly, thanks for watching this particular video and have a great day.